You welcome back. You're still watching Business Incorporated on Channels Television. Over to our commodities market updates now. And we are talking about locust beans. Well, African locust beans is a black, strong, smelly seasoning, which is rich in lipid, protein, and carbohydrate. It helps to boost immune system, relieve diseases like diarrhea, diabetes, and reduce the chance of heart attack. These health benefits have created and made it a source of food, traditional medicine, and remedy for several ailments. Both the fruit, the seed, the leaves, the nuts, the pots, the essential oils of the African locust are highly valuable. Well, a report by the National Bureau of Statistics knows that over $200 million is spent annually on imported food flavor, with a projection of 15% annual future increase. This is in competition with locust beans. We don't have to spend that much to import flavor if we use locust beans. Well, let's talk more about the economic benefits and potentials of locust beans. We have Favor Ogunironi, a research analyst with Financial Derivatives Company, telling us about this. Hello, Favor. Good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon. So we know about the health benefits and we know what the NBS said, how about $200 million is spent on importing food flavor, which we can, you know, dive back to locust beans. But what are some of the other economic potentials of locust beans in Nigeria? Um, just like you said, um, locust beans is generally used as a substitute here in Nigeria due to a substitute to seasoning cubes here in Nigeria due to the health benefits. So there is an increase in the demand for this product locally. And looking at it um, in internationally, there is that export potential there. So um, we, as in Nigeria here, there is that opportunity to export this product to the grain um, Nigerians in diaspora, that population there, there is that opportunity to take advantage of. And also, if you look at the um, locust beans trees, it produces a fruit. And this fruit, you can either derive the seeds, which is used for the local beans, properly known as iru, or the sweet pop. And that sweet pop is something that can be refined into processed, processed drinks. And also, um, so basically, these are the um, things that Nigeria can leverage on in order to boost the export um, potential of locust beans. So when we talk about the export potential, then we talk about processing, you know, the value chain and all that. How is that, does that chain even exist in Nigeria at this time? Um, usually, locust beans is pro um, processed in rural areas, and normally the process involves getting the seeds from the market, boiling them for long hours, and even then peeling off the um, the coats of the seeds using the bare, using the back of your of your feet, and also fermenting it before selling. But then, since we are talking about be it being an export product, that that means this. Um, locust beans has to be refined into something that can be easily transported. So it probably has to be um, processed into like a dry form or a pow powdered form. And that will involve um, acquisition of machines in order to improve the quality because you also, um, you also need to meet regulatory standards as well. So you need to import machines that will improve the quality, that also improve the, that also increase the quantity as well, because this is something you're exporting to people out there. So that's what the value chain process will, will be like. Okay, but I, I don't really think we have that working now. But what do you see as FDC? What do you see as the long-term export potential of low-cost beans? Um, low-cost beans is currently at its growth stage here. Um, good stage right now. Um, so what will push the exports of each product, the increase in the exports of each product is definitely the obvious one, an increase in the population of African in the Africans in diaspora and also the growing um, um, globalization, the growing recognition of African dishes as well. And especially if you consider um, companies now infusing local um, local ingredients into um, in, in order to form seasoning cubes. So that's something that can boost the market for locust beans. All right. Thank you so much, Favor, for sharing your thoughts with us on locust beans this afternoon. Thank Enjoy you. the rest of your day. Thank you so much. So we move to Zimbabwe now where more